welcome back to another satisfactory tutorial. Today, I'm going to show you how to do a hyper tube cannon. Now, if you want to experiment with it, go for it. But, this is just the basic I like to do. There's no... So change. Let's go on a small, on a small, uh, very small uh, hypertube cannons. You can make this as long as you want. You can make it as short as you want. Doesn't matter. But for the most part, let's go put up the walls because because you, you're going to need a wall for sure now to start off this hyper tube cannon we need the hyper tube cannon I mean the hyper tube to start it wherever it is there it is <laughs> okay Oop. no no, you stupid. Come on. Okay. Start off, we need three three blocks, like one, two, three to start off with. Of course, we're going to be working on the The uh, return, I mean, send, re whatever. You want to bring it out a couple. You don't have to exactly put them this far close to each other so I'm just gonna boop, bring it just like that now to you need the hyper tube entrances make sure they're facing that way when it, the light is always on the right depending on where you're going like let's say you're going that way it's always on the right always now put uh, an entrance on all of these These will send you where you're going. Whoop, wrong button. Put, cover these. <coughs> I mean, uh, fill those in. Because it will not work without that middle tube. Which we need to bring this out one. <clears throat> now, if you want to go anywhere within seconds, you're going to need to do 21 separate entries. Just like this, but a little bit bigger. Just a bit. Um, if you want to go from, like, let's say, wherever that wall is to wherever that wall is going to be, you need to do this twice. You can't just use the same tube that's going... 
going from that wall because you will get stuck in between. You want to make this twice. We are going to need la one more entry because this this entry is going to be the rest of the tube. Now let's just go to let's just loop this around. Just for the uh, sake of time. Now, this ain't going to work. Exactly. is mostly we need an entrance right there now at the end of the tube the one that's going at the wall we need an entry going right there and we need another entry but this entry, instead of going the same way, it's going to go backwards. This is pretty much like the hyper tube braking system. Now let's turn this sucker on. And give you a run through. Turn it on. Of course, you're going to need to power every single one. It won't. It won't work unless you power every single one. Unfortunately. Now it goes same thing with the end one. You need to power both of them. That's pretty much the whole dealio with it. Let's go through it. Meow. Now you've seen how it goes. Let's get rid of the brake system just to show you what it does without the brake system. Oh, well, it's not going fast enough because I don't have enough entries. Well, if you don't have the braking system, you will fly into the void. Without a doubt, you will fly into the void. Just make sure you got the braking system. Uh, I don't know why I'm doing that. I'm just a little too used to that of, because of my other world. Just to show you again for the braking system alone. This entire system is built on the braking system. Pretty much you do this entire thing for 21 entries and you'll get anywhere within minutes. That's pretty much it for this video. Don't forget to subscribe if you have. Ah, shit. I'm sorry. I broke the main thing I wanted it to not do. Don't forget to check that description.
If you haven't, hit that bell icon for further videos. Have a great day, night, evening, as much as possible. And I'll see you all in the next one. Peace. Here we go.